Welcome back to Movie Mo Show. Today we are going to review the drama war film, Fog in August. If you like our content, don't forget to like and subscribe. We post multiple times daily. Spoilers ahead. Yenish Kid Ernst Lasse is sent to a psychiatric hospital in Nazi Germany in 1944, where he works under Dr. Veithausen's supervision. Ernst, who was initially labeled as a troublemaker, fulfills his destiny and constantly disobeys in small ways. Christian Lasse, his father, has been released from a concentration camp, and although he does not intend to stay in the facility for very long, he anticipates being transported home, and eventually to America, by his father, he is refused discharge because his father has no permanent address. The Hadamar killing facility is initially designated to kill some hospital patients, but when national authorities order that the euthanasia operation and decisions be transferred to individual institutions, Dr. Veithausen is left to order his nurses to execute patients who are under their care. Sister Kiefer, the newly hired nurse, transferred from Hadamar and is prepared to use barbiturates to kill pediatric victims. Sister Sophia works to keep the kids from being poisoned in the meanwhile. A fellow patient named Nan and Ernst become friends, and over time, they learn about Dr. Veithausen's plans to kill the patients at the facility. To save himself and Nandel, he makes an effort to devise an escape strategy. Following the principles of racial hygiene, the doctor creates a strategy to progressively starve patients by giving them boiled vegetable soup with little nutrients, which pleases his Nazi superiors. Soon after, Ernst prepares to flee during an airstrike, but he is unsuccessful when a bomb is dropped close, killing Sister Sophia and injuring Nandel. Ernst accuses Veithausen of being a murderer after the nurse's funeral. Upon Dr. Veithausen's request, Paul Hechtel or Sister Kiefer, both of whom insist they weren't the murderer, kill Ernst. The other patients are informed by Nandel that Ernst has finally arrived in America. Thank you for watching and don't forget to like and subscribe.